Well, for today, you know, for a lot of people, today served as a wake-up call. Now is the time to get prepared if you're not prepared already. Now, we're about 19 miles away from the epicenter here at the Santa Monica Pier. That shaking could be felt all over Southern California. Check this out. A normal afternoon at the Santa Monica Pier interrupted by a powerful earthquake. This camera captured some of the shaking felt all over the Southland. Check out this ring video showing a Downey family and their dogs modeling perfect drop cover and hold on protocol using their dining table. Holy smokes. <gasps> I'm shaking. Experts say that kind of preparedness is going to be key when the big one hits Southern California. I want to be at least prepared for the day it does hit. We don't know if we're going to one day have an 8.9 and God forbid that we do. But I'd rather be prepared and, you know, be able to save some of my loved ones and stuff like that if things go south. Amir Gavino helps Angelinos build their emergency kits at L.A. Surplus on Santa Monica Boulevard and Vine Street. Always important. You guys have to have your drinking water. This is always going to be important. You always have these seals, so they're never going to get contaminated. He says supplies have been flying off the shelves recently. We are ordering things left and right right now. We are hoping we're going to get stuff in. Like, we just had shipments come in uh, not that long ago, probably less than a couple of days, and they've been out the window those get whatever you can right now that's what all my customers are doing right now experts say you generally want to have enough food water and medications to last for at least 10 days it's also a good idea to have a battery powered or hand crank radio and extra batteries and also make sure to have copies of personal documents passports and birth certificates you never know when it's going to happen so I, I'm going to pray on everybody and hope they you know get ready soon and don't wait for that day that's going to come down hard on us now, I have to admit, I'm one of those people that's been saying for a long time, I have got to get ready for the next earthquake. Today was my wake-up call. I finally bought one of these grab-and-go emergency kits just to start. Certainly not everything that we need to be safe. Still need to come up with a plan, an emergency plan, and get a lot more things. Uh, but when it comes to preparedness, anything is better than nothing. Reporting live in Santa Monica, Chelsea Edwards. I'll send it back to you in the studio.